Hey, this is Ali at SafeNet. I'm going to show you three different types of license manager. The three types are called admin LM, integrated LM, and external LM. So let me explain uh, the differences between them. Uh, the usual admin LM, aspLMS.exe, uh, is of course part of the installation of runtime. When we install runtime, we also get a Windows service called aspLMS.exe, which listens on port 9047. So this is the usual way of working. But of course, we also have runtimeless environment, or as it, as it used to be called, driverless, meaning that you don't have to install runtime. So if you don't have to install runtime, where is the license manager? So there are two options. The very first option is to have it integrated inside the licensing API and the enveloped application, meaning that if you use licensing API and you don't install the runtime, then don't be worried the license manager will be inside the licensing API and the enveloped API and uh, everything will work fine. Uh, of course, this is, uh, this is very common to be using when you don't use uh, runtime. Uh, for instance, if you use driverless key. So if you use a driverless Sentinel Azure key, this means that you want to have the benefit of not using the runtime and you don't want to install the runtime maybe. So don't worry the license manager will be inside the licensing API and the enveloped application. Also, if you, if you are going to use SL user mode, SL user mode means that you, can, you don't have to install runtime. So if you don't have to install, don't worry, the integrated license manager is inside there waiting to be, di to be doing the working of uh, license management. But what, is the, what was the problem with integrated LM is the fact that since the license manager resides inside the licensing API, this means that if for some reason, for instance, there is a bug in the license manager or you want to install something newer, you are not able to do any convenient way to install the newer license manager. Instead, you will have to create a new enveloped application and to uh, ha you to be using the new licensing API and to uh, integrate it inside your application source code. So a lot of work every time you want to change the license manager. Unlike uh, the runtime installation here, if you want to your end user to use the latest uh, runtime environment, you just tell him, uh, please uh, install the latest driver. So we just install as the install.exe or any other way of installation of the runtime environment and that's it, the newer license manager is over there. But here it's a little bit more complicated. So what we have done is we have created an external license, license manager specifically for runtime less. So instead of having the license manager inside the licensing API and the envelope application, you will get a, an external file called ASP underscore RT runtime, runtime and this file can be replaced if you uh, as a, an ISV, as a software window, you would like someday to change it. So where you can find the ASP RT is very easy. When you envelope an application, in addition to the enveloped application, you, you will also get immediately an ASP RT that you can provide to your uh, end user. So once you want to create a new external license manager, just use your envelope, create a new enveloped application with a new ask party and, sh and send it to your end user. So this way uh, it's very convenient to change the license manager with, without, uh, without uh, integrating once again the licensing API and creating a new enveloped application and sending it to uh, to your end user. Only the Asparty can be replaced. Uh, these three license managers are different. Of course, you can, uh, in most of the cases, see only the admin LM or you can see 
in uh, where you don't have to install the runtime, you see the integrated LM or the external LM. But bear in mind that it can be that it's less common, of course, it's less common, but it, it can happen that one machine will have all these three different license manager because you install the runtime environment, so you have the admin LM, but you also have been using the enveloped application licensing API, which already have integrated LM, and even you uh, provided this as part of So, who is going to be uh, the dominant license manager if there is uh, all three together? All this kind of information you can find in our documentation, uh, but this is only a basics of uh, what are the three different license managers that we have. Thank you for watching.